everyone. I am here with another Dollar Tree haul. Yes, it took me about, what, two weeks? A little bit over two weeks, maybe even more, to, to get back out there and uh, buy what I needed to buy as essentials for my household, like cleaning supplies and juices and snacks and toilet paper and things of that sort. And I go to Dollar Tree first because it's closer to my house and I don't have to go to a big store to find it and at better, at better prices uh, most of the time. Now they are stocked up. At least the one by my house is stocked up, which is a good thing. I find everything I'm looking for and at the same time I did this time like I did before went through the other aisles and saw if there I mean and looked in, for new items or I had repurchases things of that sort excuse the messy bun excuse the no makeup but I will tell you after excusing all of that I am very happy with my skin lately, so uh, I didn't put any makeup on today. Today is one of those no makeup work at home type of days. And I am very happy again with my skin. My eczema is clearing up, which I'm very happy for. I got some right here and some behind my ears. Very excited that, you know, that is calming down a bit, even though the heat makes it worse. But I haven't been out as much to trigger that and my moisturizing lotions and my skincare is helping a lot. My under eye, I know I have some dark circles, but I am very happy with my eye serum because it is doing its job. Yes, the dark circles and the little bags from lack of sleep are showing, but my fine lines really aren't. And I am 43. So that is something that I always try to take care of, my skin. And yes, I do try different products and I do try new things uh, and not everything works for me, but there are certain things that work very well and those are my dailies. I try new things and review new things just to let you know if they're worth your money. So here we go. Let's get back to this Dollar Tree haul. I don't go in any order. I just pick up a bag and show you what's in it. And this one is a pretty decently sized one. So uh, first things first, I do want to show you that I get this turmeric. Uh, it is 12 capsules. I get this for uh, my mom. She likes uh, taking this dietary supplement. And I, when I find it, I get at least two or three each time I go because for 12 capsules, a dollar. So I pay $2 for 24 capsules, which is not bad at all. I also found this Sleek Trust Me Shampoo to relax. Sleek Trust Me Shampoo to relax and clean. That's what that says. Uh, this is something new. I have not seen this ever at the Dollar Tree. So I went ahead and got it because I wanna see if this actually helps the scalp. I, I don't know. It says a shampoo brush. So it says massage the scalp while shampooing therapeutic bristles designed for all hair types and hair lengths fulfills everyday styling needs while promoting healthy hair. Des designed for natural hair textures of all lengths. We'll see how that works. I'm all about masks and so is my daughter. Uh, I found this Global Beauty Care Hydrogel Face Mask offers intense hydration to revitalize smooth and softened skin, 15 minute facial therapy. And it has three facial treatments for a dollar. So I do wanna try this. Again, <laughs> there's times where I try these masks on my IG TV or on Instagram or just on certain videos. So, so I'm not sure what social media you will see this on, but I will bring another video up with one of these masks and try it on and see what see how it feels see if it it's even worth me trying them this is something new too the freeman smoothing jojoba oil hair mask so th this is for your hair so again another mask but for the hair and see how that works i also found some other masks and uh, let's see we have the green tea facial cleanser and face mask activated charcoal face mask this is a step one step two type of deal and same here this is the cucumber exfoliating scrub and the grapefruit clay mask 
uh, step one, step two as well. Uh, it is by Spa April Bath and Shower. So these are new items that I found. Another item that would be great to try. I did find an, uh, stuff from Arts and for Arts and Crafts. Uh, there, uh, these uh, chalk writers. I found a white one this time and a purple one, which uh, I'm trying to get as many colors as I can. I know I found a few before, but I don't have the purple or the white. Found a pair of sunglasses that I thought were cute. I will buy occasionally sunglasses from the Dollar Tree. They're just a dollar and I always have to wear some type of sunglasses uh, when I am out and about just because I did have LASIK surgery uh, when I was 26 and it just helps. The sensitivity to the sun is not severe, but it is enough where I feel like I, I feel more comfortable wearing sunglasses when I am out there than when I'm not wearing them at all. Those are cute. So I just thought, why not? They're a dollar. But I do have other ones that, like the, the ones with the orange lens, so, or orange yellow lens that you could use when um, it's raining. Those work great for me. Next item that I got is this little cute thing here. This is for me. My favorite uh, Disney character is Mickey Mouse. And I did get a couple of them. This is the first one that came, <laughs> that came out of that bag, but I think I bought two or three. I found these new little mini uh, eyeshadow palettes from LA Colors, Sunset Break and Morning Glow. These are cute little mini palettes that I know I probably would enjoy this one just because it has a little bit of more color in it than this one that's more neutral but either or I wanted to try both just to give an everyday look here and maybe more of a smoky look with this one and see how that works you know evening day and for a dollar and a lot of the LA color uh palettes have been pretty good for me i found a hard candy uh eyeshadow quad in the very smoke uh smoky gray tones here this is a smoke and mirrors that's what they call it uh and it says mod quad baked eyeshadow we'll see how this works if you would like for me to try and review any even if it's just first impressions on these, let me know. I do try some of these and see how they work the first time ever, and we'll go from there. The next item that I found, this is something new. I found this in the baby section, but I wanted to try it for us. This is a Polish and Glow dual-sided microfiber cloth. And uh, it, says, it says, thoughtfully designed bath essentials brand that helps you achieve radiant, confident, whole body beauty so you feel ready to shine from head to toe every single day. Get clean, polished clean. So this is another item that I'm definitely going to uh, try in the bath. Uh, if you remember last time I bought a, uh, like a little loofah that was handheld kind of and it was almost this color it was more on the greener tone but that one was a dollar as well and that one's in use and I'm liking it quite a bit so I'm going to see if that microfiber cloth is going to be good and I may even try it because like I said it's for it was in the baby section so I may even try it with my grandchildren see if uh, you know it's a good scrubber next from spa April bath and shower is the charcoal soap and sponge in one so this is something new as well. Went ahead and got that. A lot of new items. Here's the other Mickey Mouse. Told you, I think I got two or three. Not sure. Then I found new makeup uh, besides the eyeshadow palettes. I found new e.l.f. the eyeliner pencil, which is one of my favorite. The coffee is one of my favorite eyeliner pencils. Um, and then the longwear lip lighting pencil. This one is a Mob Lux. I like this color as well. They're for a dollar. You can't beat that. And I rave about a lot of the very affordable e.l.f. products. These two, very affordable and very nice. I even use the coffee pencil sometimes to uh, start off my eyebrows and then brush in whatever else and fill in whatever else I have to fill in. 
So it works great both ways. And, and it's actually an eyeliner pencil, not a brow pencil, but I like the way it works on my brows as well. Uh, the Maybelline 830 Shiny Bronze Lasting Drama pencil here is an automatic pencil and it is this beautiful, beautiful color right here. I like this because this will give you a very, very illuminating uh, eye look if you apply it on your waterline. Uh, so that is something that I like this for. It was a dollar Maybelline. Can't beat that, can you? Uh, I went ahead and purchased a candle lighter. We were in need of that. The power here went out uh, a few times during these storms lately that we've been having. I definitely need another one because the one we have is already uh, heading out or almost empty. I did decide to get some of their fashion jewelry, little sets, earring sets. Look at how cute this one is. Uh, I know, of course, this jewelry may not last a long time, but a few times that you wear it, and as long as you know how to take care of fashion jewelry, it can last you a while uh, and not change color, but it all depends on the quality as well. But I just thought they were cute, and again, you can... Uh, use them a few times and not feel bad that oh it broke and it was only a dollar uh you know or oh it changed colors after two uses so that means each use costed you 50 cents not bad instead of saying oh it broke and it costed me 40 bucks just an fyi so i have purchased some from there i actually have some studs that i'm wearing from one of their little sets and this is uh like the third time i'm wearing these and i am actually liking the way they look really cute why not next item that i found it is a little clear plastic plastic bag what i like about this is that it's an organizer so you can use this in many ways you can use it to put it in your um, purse to organize items on the outside or use it as a little travel bag for your necessities. Uh, it is bigger than what a TSA approved bag should be, but you could use this to take with you in not a carry-on, but more into your luggage uh, or on a road trip not a bad idea so i think this is great a great little organizer for a dollar you can't beat that this is going to be a long one people i got another diabetics hydrating lotion what i like about this is that it's fragrance free it's very good for your feet if your feet or your hands have issues with dryness which my whole body has issues with dryness from head to toe uh, so this works great as a uh, hydrating lotion for pretty much your whole body. But I love, I love the way it feels on my hands and my feet. I found the Reach uh, Anti-Plaque 6 in 1 Benefits Mouthwash. I, that's a repurchase. I like purchasing that. Uh, over the door hooks. Uh, these are three individual over the door hooks. And I like using these a lot Uh or like towels or um, scarves or purses or things of that sort. But these I bought specifically for a room that we are um, setting up for our grandchildren or a guest room pretty much, but our grandchildren and my parents are the ones that use it the most. So I'm setting it up to fit their needs. So these are gonna go over the closet door. I found some pine salt. I like to buy this because it makes up to five gallons, if not more. Uh, and this is a multi-surface cleaner. This one's new, Tropical Flowers. I haven't seen this one. It's new to me. I haven't seen this one at the Dollar Tree, so I went ahead and got that. That's a, that's not a, rep well, the Pine Soul itself is a repurchase. The fragrance is different. I went ahead and got a mousse. This is something new that I saw at the Dollar Tree. I haven't tried this, but I'm gonna go ahead and try it and see how it works on my hair. Bella Linda hair mousse if any of you have tried it comment below and let me know what you think about this found some little crafter square canvases uh, i found one 
in this size here. I wonder if I, did I buy one or two? I don't remember. Diabetic foot cream. You see how I said this works amazing in your whole body, but I love it in my hands and feet. Well, then there's one that's specifically for the feet. And I do, and it says relieves dry, cracked skin, soothes skin, discomfort, fragrance free. I love to buy this for our, for me, for my daughter and for my dad. My dad is diabetic and he definitely, definitely needs to keep his feet and everything, you know, moisturized and clean and just not having any issues with cracking or anything like that because uh, that can turn into something worse when it comes to you being a diabetic. Uh, Reach uh, Floss, also a repurchase. I found a two, in, two plus one bonus super glue gel. I always like to keep super glue for just different things. Uh, you never know when you might need it. So uh, this one I like because it's a gel and it says self, uh, no runs or drips, instant bond, self piercing cap. So I haven't tried the gel before, so I found it, I got it. The Lysol uh, Power Toilet Bowl Cleaner, one of my favorite repurchase. Uh, the Armor All-Purpose Car Wash, and this is 10 full ounces. This is something uh, new that I found. I have found the multi-purpose cleaner, the glass cleaner from Armor All, but not the all-purpose car wash one. So I was definitely happy to find this, and it is a 10 full ounce bottle for a dollar. I found some, of course, toys. You can't... Uh, leave without getting toys for your grandchildren at least i couldn't so i found these uh this little set of uh water squirters i got two of course i got two grandchildren so i'm pretty sure they will enjoy that i got some candles i love to get candles strawberries and cream and berry crumble the i've smelled the strawberries and cream before Oh my god, the berry crumble smells so so good. And the strawberries and cream smells great and very strong actually. Uh but I feel like um whenever I turn this one on, I've purchased this one before. Whenever I turn it on in my room, I'm like, "Oh my god, it feels like you have like a strawberries and cream uh dessert like in your room. Like you're ready to eat it." not a good idea because <laughs> it just makes you want more dessert. I also found the Art Foam Roller with Tray for crafty, crafty days, uh, which I love to do arts and crafts. And I have not put a video of any of my DIYs in a very long time. I think over a year. I don't know. They may come up pretty soon. I found these cute little bins and i have some ideas of what to do with them and then i found this one here so as you can see there are different sizes and of course this one's open from the bottom and the sides this one isn't so i decided to get both styles and uh, we'll see what we can come up with i found this cute little tray here too i thought this looks so adorable that i can just paint this and decorate it in so many ways or just by painting it i will give it a different different look but you know how cute my little miniature perfumes would look on this just a thought and then i also found this a little chalkboard blackboard easel i thought this was really cute for a dollar continuing on with crafty items Crafter Square had a lot in this Dollar Tree. It just has a whole section. I was like, oh my gosh. So I got the clips, the craft clamps. I had not found these at any of the Dollar Trees. And finally, they came to our Dollar Tree. And I got two. So I got a total of 12. Six in each pack. Uh, also, the double-sided tape. I have a lot of use for double-sided tape. So I was very happy to find this more toys like for the beach for my little my little g babies and then i got this for my older g baby boy so he can uh do it with build it constructed 
with his grandpa. I thought this would be, be such a cute thing to do with, for him and uh, he can go ahead and do it with his grandpa and see if they can get this little motorbike, you know, built. So I thought that was really cute. Had to get it. Got some matches, a pack of 250. So two boxes, 250 in both, in both. So 125 in each. Got that. I got some uh, the Jasmine Lotus uh, Breeze dryer sheets. I think these smell so amazing. So I went ahead and got that. We got some deodorants, three purchases. Another little canvas. I thought I had gotten more than one. And the Tire Foam Spray Armoral. This is a good product if you wash your cars at home, which we don't always wash them at home, but once in a while we get out there and wash our own cars. Why not? I don't do it that often, just to let you know. My boys and my husband, they're the ones that take care of that. So that's everything that I found at the Dollar Tree. Repurchases, new items, crafty items, uh, you know, things for the hair, the body, the face, accessories, just a little bit of everything. Uh, very excited. And again, I don't go that often, so you won't see a lot of these Dollar Tree hauls uh, from me. You may see them once every two weeks, once every three weeks, because one, the mask wearing bothers me. I feel like I'm getting smothered. I am claustrophobic, so that's not something that makes me comfortable, but I wear it. I wear it for the protection of everybody out there from me and me for protecting myself from anybody else. The, mask, the masks that we wear, I can say are not protection 100% or I can even say not even 50%, but a little protection is better than none. So again, I do wear them, and but that's why I don't go out that often to these stores because I can't stand wearing them for a long time. So I do what I have to do. I, I did walk the aisles this time, but I did not take that long to do so. So there's probably other new items out there that I did not get a hold of just because of that fact that I did not want to stay in the store that long. And I wasn't even there with that many people. On the contrary, I think there was only a few because it was early. So I do want to say um, and emphasize that if you do not have to go out there to be around a lot of people, or if you are if you are immune compromised, try to avoid it. Um, things are reopening and I'm very happy for that because our economy needs it uh we need to move forward but again with caution it's just my thought my opinion and i just hope everybody stays safe to the best of their ability i want to say thank you for watching this video thank you for tuning into my channel i really appreciate it and i will see you on my next one bye